Hey, I'm Ada, and today I'll show you how to use start and end frames to create videos with precise camera movement between two points in Kive. We'll go through three quick examples. A seamless 360 degree rotation around your subject, a smooth zoom from a wide shot to a close up, and a product rotation showing front and back views. All right, let's start with the seamless loop. Make sure you're in video mode next to the prompt bar. Now pick an image from your library and click Apply as Start Frame. Next, let's set the end frame. For a perfect loop, select the same image again and apply as end frame. In the prompt area, type camera rotating 360 degrees around the model. Then click Generate. Kive will create a smooth rotation from your start frame back to your end frame. A perfect endless spin. Okay, now let's make a wide to close transition. We'll use two different images, one wide, one close. Select the wide image as your start frame and the close up as your end frame. In the prompt, type slow zoom in, then click generate. You'll get a smooth zoom that keeps all the details and text clear. Finally, let's do a product rotation. Say you have a front and a back view of your product. Pick the front as your start frame and the back as your end frame. In the prompt, type turn bottle 180 degrees. Click generate and that's it. You can experiment with any kind of movement, pans, tilts, rotations, or zooms, but these basics are a great place to start. Start and end frames let you bring still images to life with full control over how the camera moves.